All right, guys, so I installed the new master cylinder yesterday on this. Uh, I'm gonna undo these two screws and uh, fill the brake fluid in this one. Oh, and then I'm gonna pump the brakes, obviously, in order to bleed the brake system. But uh, I don't have a small little hose. Typically, you'd hook up a little hose to this and put it into a bottle or something. So uh, I'm probably just gonna let it drip down into a little container and then spray it off a brake cleaner at the end but uh that's pretty much how you drain your brake system this one only has rear brakes so it shouldn't be too bad this is brand new so it should break loose pretty easy yep break very loose you don't want any dust or any contaminants in here so make sure everything's pretty clean since it's a brand new master cylinder everything is fairly clean You're gonna pull this off. You're gonna have another little rubber piece inside there. And that's pretty much your gasket for your master cylinder. And just to make sure I don't lose these screws, I'm just gonna stick them back in here. So as you click it, you hold it down so it creates pressure in the back for your brake fluid to leak out of the little nipple. So I'm going to refill this. I'm going to click it a few more times. So I refilled that. I'm going to click this a few more times to get a little more brake. Oh, you can start to feel tension in it now. That's a good thing. So I'm going to click it a few more times until it starts to feel stiff. And I'm gonna hold it all the way down and I'm gonna open the little nip on the back. After I open the little nip on the back, I'm gonna reclose it and repeat the process. So again, I'm gonna click this a few times and then hold it down. So I clicked it a few times. I'm gonna show you guys this side. Promise it's a lot easier when you're not trying to film a video. So that's the little nipple on the back. That that is actually it. So I'm gonna hit the brakes a few more times, click it a few times, and then I'm gonna open this. It's the wrong way. I'm going to repeat the process until the brake fluid is completely clear. Alright, so now that all clear. Topped off my master reservoir, my master cylinder. I'm pretty happy with this so far. Put your cap back on. And then tighten it snug. Do not over tighten. You do not want to strip this out. You'll be replacing it. But make sure it's snug because you don't want it leaking. You don't want any leaks in your brakes. That's all it takes to bleed your brakes. Very, very easy. I got nice tight brakes.